I know there's an effort to always try to contort what I say. And by the way, I'm lit, but I'm going to make sense. But I want to make the announcement. To whom it may concern. And also to y'all Twitter niggas who be just tweeting bullshit to me too. I know in whatever like little weird plan y'all have or like whatever psychosis y'all are experiencing. Like y'all are going to get me and Drake going at it. It's not happening. I talk to the homie Drake. And I say homie because we have a cordial relationship. It's my favorite rapper but we have a cordial relationship. We both acknowledge what's going on. I said this last stream, I could say, yo, Kendrick's about to leak. He's trying to find a reason to fi drop five more diss songs. Nobody covers it. I could I could say one thing. I heard Drake got some shit coming. Everybody covers it. Why? Because it continues the narrative. And for you Drake fans, shut your stupid ass up. Me and Drake, we're cool. We're always cool. We're, we, we understand the moment we're in. He understands it for me. I understand it for him. He understands at this moment, there's so many outlets that want to use me against him, that want to twist my words. It, 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 to, to just say simply, y'all have failed. Um, obviously, I'm not trying to run PR for Drake, though. Right? He's a grown-ass man. He can do what he want. Um, it's interesting how people try to now twist everything I do because... I've always been the person that's been the voice for Young Boy, voice for Playboy Cardi, the voice for Six Nine. Any artist who I have a close personal relationship that I could talk to and ask questions, I've always been the person to like, de like uh, um, put out information that is accurate to what they got going on. Unfortunately, the rest of y'all favorite media personalities who are upset, they don't talk to the main guys no more. All they do is just sit back and lie. So they need to have a soul searching within themselves. Why don't none of the niggas who are relevant, why young boy only trust me? What did the rest of you niggas do? Why the fuck did 6 9 and his Pete not fuck with y'all? What the fuck did the rest of y'all do? Why does Drake at this moment don't give a fuck about not another media personality but me? What the fuck did y'all do? So instead of trying to twist my words, how about y'all just sit here by Papa's feet and realize the only time you'll get an update other than he saying it will be from me, okay? Now, you could try to twist my words, and I understand. Good try. But to the educated people and even to the, 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 the smarter fans, that just doesn't work, okay? Um, there's also people who are running campaigns, and, you know, hey, everybody get their money. Because I know how campaigns go. Uh, so they'll use pieces of what I said to be the indictment of Drake. I want to also say this to you guys and for the rest of the people. This battle that has ensued will not turn me into something that I don't want to be. I do not want to be DJ Head for Kendrick. And when I mean that, I don't want to be that for Drake. DJ Head is a completely biased, but he should be biased because the nigga is a DJ for Kendrick Lamar. Of course, he's not supposed to say nothing nice about nobody else. If you watch my entire career, I've been critical, skeptical, doubtful. I've given praise. I've given, I've, I've talked shit on his behalf just because of me. I've been pretty, yeah, I have my, I have my particular favorite but I'm nobody's PR and I'm nobody like flat out biased, biased, like puppet. So, you know, um, and by the way, these were all the conversations that we did have hundred percent. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm not going to turn to somebody who's going to be completely biased to Drake because I, I, I like to reserve my right to criticize. When I, when I hear off tune song by sexy red, is it you? I, I, I want to say, I don't like that shit. I don't like it. I like it. Sorry. I like to be that person. So I've realized, you know, and I said that, you know, rap is now turned to politics because you have to pick a side and only operate as the side you picked is rocking with. Here's the thing, too. Um, for the people who, you know, might be like, oh, whatever, whatever. And, and, and it's kind of interesting. You know, 
I've been the mouthpiece pause for the majority of rappers that y'all like. It's kind of interesting that it's only a problem when it's Drake. By the way, I would be the mouthpiece for, for Kendrick too, except he has a huge digital team and he has DJ Head. So that's how they get their information out. For whatever reason, they don't want to communicate. I talked to some people in TDE. They don't want to communicate with um, maybe information. You know, obviously, they probably have their own reasons. But I guess I say that to say um, for the people who try to, number one, say I'm on OVO's payroll, that couldn't be further from the truth because I criticize Drake even now. Number two, for the other people who would like to take my words and try to, in whatever weird, twisted thing you got going on, try to put it against Drake, you need to have some soul searching. It's a reason why the rapper that ev everybody else, and by the way, we, we have to acknowledge, this year has been about, and I'm talking about media-wise, yeah, Drake and Kendrick, but it's like, is Drake falling off? Did somebody get shot at his house? Is Drake... The, the rapper that's ended up feeding the media, y'all got to wonder why he don't fuck with y'all. Why he don't give y'all interviews? Why he don't comment on y'all posts? Why he don't text y'all with the... I don't know why. And I don't care. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? But I do want to uh, put out a very friendly note to like all of the media out there. Um, I hope y'all realize that Ak has been the same person this year as he was in the year that whenever I fell asleep. As he was in the year when he wild and out said, yo, who top five you smoking on? When he said my top five is Drake, 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 Drake. I'm the same person. It's only y'all opinions or y'all intentions have changed. Mine has not. Okay? <laughs> I haven't changed my favorite rapper, nor I've changed anything else. So I say that to say, um, you know, f f for, f for the likes uh, of... A few haters and a few salty media personalities and a few um, confused or disgruntled fans or maybe some fans of people that maybe not like Drake. Um, me and the boy is cool. And we'll leave it at that. Okay? Don't ma don't mean I won't report things. And, and this is for Drake fans. Y'all are, are delusional too. Don't mean I won't report things positive about him or negative. Shit, I like laughing at a nigga too. And I'm pretty sure when he's talking shit about me, he like laughing at me. It, it is what it is, right? Okay, with all that being said, and for whatever reason, I needed to put that out because I've every day there's a new clip that pops up of me speaking about Drake and it feels like all I do is just sit up and make these declaratory, uh, declarative statements about him that is intended to go viral and it's like, no, there's niggas who like him or hate him that are using my clips because they're like, hey, I don't know what the fuck y'all did. Drake don't trust none of y'all no more. He don't fuck with none of y'all. <laughs> Not one of y'all, okay? So whatever y'all did, bruh, again, I get this is a business, but all, 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 all I'm asking, unless y'all won't smoke with me, and I, and I suggest nobody won't smoke with me. I suggest that very, in the nicest, humblest way, and I'll pray for me and y'all, if y'all have a problem with Drake, don't misquote me. If you're trying to use my words against him, don't misquote me because you almost use me as your tool when I don't like to, I, I get at niggas directly. I don't, if I got a problem with Lil Baby, I don't need another nigga's voice for Lil Baby. I don't need to be like, yo, let me find out who don't like Lil Baby and I use it. No, I'll say that half retarded, dumbass nigga who's getting sandwich hugged by Michael Rubin and some other weird nigga. Okay, I don't need some other nigga to say it. I like to say it myself. You know what I mean? I don't need to pass the gun to somebody else. I like to shoot my goddamn self. That's the point. So I, that's that's as friendly as my my, my warning is going to be to um, the rest of the media. And it's not about them talking about me. It's about I feel like I'll see things that I've said, but wildly out of context. Like I'm a hater. Like I've switched sides. Like, oh, no, he's on the agenda of no. Like, there is no side for me. Drake is cool, but I like some of Kendrick shit, and it'll continue to be that way. Drake don't pay me, and I got to get up on this bitch and get my own goddamn money. And before I become, you know what I mean, I'm over here doing a business, bro. I'm not over here, like, you know, fighting Stan Wars. I do like his music, though. Anyway, okay. That's my disclaimer. I think I'm good. All right. Really, I was trying to crash out. I couldn't. 
I need to crash out on somebody. <clears throat> okay. So, with that being said, and and also, this is a new new wave, a new thing. I'm Because I, I, I told him to. I'm like, yeah, bro, like, because me and him, we didn't talk for like a while. And I'll, I'll be a little honest with that. I intentionally didn't talk to him for like a week. Because everything I say, I think came from him. It's not true. And and I feel bad because like now y'all are using sometimes my thoughts and my humor against a guy and a, and a, and a rapper I like. Like that's kind of corny, right? Like, you know what I mean? He's not, like if he does tell me something and I use it or I say it, a lot of times I'll say, yo, he told me. But when people think you're the official spokesperson and they keep clowning the nigga, be like, yo, look what this, yo, act said this. Bro, half the time be joking. And half the time I joke on him. And I've joked on him before. He knows that. You know what I mean? So that's one of the reasons. But, you know, um, I, I, I guess I said all that to say, you know, me, me and him, we, we chopped it up. And um, he absolutely gets it. And um, he understands what everybody's doing. And also, he knows I'm doing a brilliant job. So, you know, uh, kudos to him. Anyway, 